What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new news video. Today what I have for you guys, we're going to talk about some free Modern Warfare 3 Operator rewards that you can now get. So there's a promotion that has gone live and that has to do with Monster where now you can redeem and get yourself some Operator rewards and much more different things even before the release of Modern Warfare 3. So I'm going to show you guys how you can do that, what the rewards are and all that with today's video. I'm also going to talk about some other things that I think that you need to know, just random news topics that we have going on. But before we do start, if you find the video informative or helpful, consider hitting that subscribe button i did upload a video earlier today going over all the brand new operator bundles releasing in the season 5 reloaded update as well as the date so if you want some photos some showcasing and just to see what the bundles are going to look like make sure you check out that last video but anyways let's go ahead let's jump into it so this first topic has to do with modern warfare 2 the m13c is now available for you to unlock via a challenge so if you didn't get it during the shadow siege event you can now get it by getting 35 hip fire operator kills using any assault rifle and you will automatically unlock it so i just wanted to let you guys know about that another thing is the brand new pistol has an issue where you can't equip akimbo on it and if you've maxed out the daemon you won't even be able to use the akimbo to complete your other challenges to complete for the camo and the mastery and all that and they ended up posting saying this this will be fixed in the next upcoming patch people who already progressed past level 20 will have to wait a tiny bit longer after the patch for the akimbo to be unlocked for their accounts but anyone who hasn't hit level 20 yet will unlock it immediately after the patch so it, it doesn't make really too much sense to me so if you've already hit the level and you're supposed to get it you're not going to get it you're going to have to wait a little bit longer so if you are grinding the pistol out i would recommend that you stop at level 19 until this patch goes live where it fixes it and then you can hit level 20 so that way you get it right away rather than if you're already maxed out you're gonna have to wait a little bit until it's actually available for you to get so it's very unfair but it is call of duty and i just wanted to make you aware of this information but going on to the next thing that we have is going to be the brand new modern warfare 3 gameplay leak so we have a brand new perk system that's coming to mw3 which is going to be using gears we've talked about this quite a few times already but just to summarize if you have gloves on that's a perk if you have a vest on that could give you a perk if you have a helmet on or some boots those will give you different perks so there's going to be a total of four different perks that you can put on well some of the glove perks actually have been leaked it says there's the assault gloves which is wall jumping accuracy and time to ads is improved then you have the custom gloves which is increased weapon swap speed you have the scavenger gloves resupply ammo and throwing knives from dead players the specialist gloves throw equipment further reset fuse timer on thrown back grenades tactical combat gloves enables reloading while sprinting and then finally you have the marksman gloves which is going to be reducing the sway and flinch while ads so this is just the glove side of things you can only put on one of them so you have to pick which one you like put that one on and then there's obviously the other gears which we don't have any leaks on exactly what they're gonna have but i believe for the boots there's gonna be like ninja perk that's gonna be returning so every single different gear is gonna have a different perk that you can put on and these are the glove ones that we have so what are your thoughts and opinions on that but anyways let's go on and let's talk about the free modern warfare 3 rewards that you can start getting now a while back before the official announcement of mw3 someone ended up leaking a artwork from monster and call of duty it seems like they were doing a collaboration or promotion there was also a link to a website when you go to the website it would be offline and now it has officially gone public and the promotion is now live I have a link down to the website in the description but upon going into the website it's going to ask you to log in to start claiming and redeeming these different rewards and this is what the page looks like after i made an account and i signed in it's going to say upload receipts to start claiming your rewards so what this is is after you buy monster energy cans you it will take a screenshot of the receipt you'll upload it here to this website and then they will give you rewards now depending on how many receipts you upload there's going to be a different amount of rewards that you can get the first reward is going to be the inner beast weapon blueprint and 15 minutes of double xp they put a question mark in the screenshot but i have a photo of the weapon blueprint this is what it's going to look like by the way, all these rewards are only going to be available in Modern Warfare 3 and they are not available in MW2. So you'll be able to start using these items on November 10th with the full release of the game. And I don't even believe they're going to be available in the beta. But the second reward that you can get is going to be a brand new operator called the Beast Operator Skin. And along with that, you get a 15 minute double XP token. The photo is a little bit blurry. I tried to AI enhance it, but this is what the operator looks like. The models are a little bit odd looking. I'm not going to lie. I don't know why they sort of look like this. It doesn't even look like it's a Call of Duty type of operator, right? It looks weird. But this is the first operator skin that you get because there's going to be a second one. The third reward is going to be the caught in the cross crosshairs weapon vinyl along with another 15 minute double xp token and this is what it looks like then at reward number four you're going to be able to get another operator this one is called the zero chill operator skin and then with it you're also going to get a 15 minute double xp token 
And then going on, there's reward number five and reward number six. Don't exactly show you what it is. It just says future season content plus 15 minute double XP for both of them. And then the last one, which is reward number seven, there's going to be 15 minute of double XP. So these are all the different types of rewards that you can get from this promotion. And once again, as I said, by uploading receipts, you'll get these rewards. So what I would recommend you do if you do plan on getting this is instead of purchasing like five monster energy cans at the same time, I believe you should purchase them separately. So you get five different receipts and then you can upload those. And then that way you can get the promotion. And I do believe that this works on older monster energy cans. So maybe if you have some older receipts that could potentially work because it does say, does your can have a monster energy claw? It qualifies. So that means that they could potentially just accept any random monster energy drink that you may have gotten in the past. And it doesn't necessarily have to have the Call of Duty promotion logo and like the picture of ghosts that they have in the background and all that. So if you know anyone who drinks monster regularly, if they have a old receipt or a receipt saved, try to get that from them and test it out. And if they don't have the receipt saved, then you can ask them if from now on they could just send you the receipts because all you really need is the receipt, not the can itself, and you'll be good. Now, the thing is they do validate the receipts, so maybe they could potentially look at the date and not qualify them It's if it's before the month of September. So who knows exactly how that's going to go. But what I can tell you is just from now on, you can upload the receipts and each receipt that you upload will give you these rewards. And you have plenty of time because these rewards aren't going to go live until November 10th. And even after November 10th, they're talking about seasonal content reward so this potentially could be a promotion that's going to go on for the long term now on top of that i do believe this is going to be one of many that we're going to get typically as we get closer to launch more promotions start appearing in mw2 we got the mountain dew we got the burger king which even appeared after the launch of mw2 we also ended up seeing the jack links gilly outfit and whole set that we got so i do believe that there's going to be even more promotions and more rewards that we'll be releasing so as we get more information on that always cover the video show you exactly what the promotion is and how to get it just like in this video anyways this is pretty much everything that you need to know in regards to this promotion but other than that there's still a lot of other plenty of things to look forward to we do have season six confirmed to be releasing on september 27th which is going to be later at the end of this month this is probably going to end up being the biggest season that we have gotten based on just the huge halloween event there's a whole bunch of Halloween operators. There's a big event that's even going to change the entire map. The Haunting of Almazra is an event that's also going to potentially be releasing as well. And there's just so much to talk about and cover in regards to Season 6. So I'll start posting more videos on that very soon. And then on top of that, I'm also going to cover for you guys everything that you need to know about the Season 5 Reloaded rewards. We do have a lot more rewards than we thought were going to be available. And I'm going to cover that for you guys and show you guys exactly how to get all of them. But anyways, that's all that I got for you guys in today's video. If you found the video informative or helpful, consider hitting that subscribe button so you always stay up to date on the latest call of duty news and updates but anyways been your boy Chito. hopefully i'll be seeing you guys again peace